So I'm here in Belgium, not very far from Liège, where they have a real good, big international gun factory. RCS Templier, so it means RCS of the Templars. Going into this road here, so I, I, said, I think it looks like a, it's a soccer club. But there, if I go to that church, there's a place called uh, Villers du Temple. Villers le Temple. So I'm going to have a look well, first here. So here's the coat of arms of the, uh, the, 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 the Templar like village where I am, with three things in it for Isis, Horus, and Seth, three sort of pyramids and red or white of the, uh, the, the, the Templars and the, uh, the United Kingdom of Pharaoh. So there we are, Villers le Temple. I knew I had to come here. Yesterday some horse riding girls, they took me in a big fancy car and it was, it was out of my way, but I knew I had to go here. And now I know there's a commandery of the Templars somewhere. So here it is, it's an ancient commandery of the Templars here in Villers. Le Temple, yeah, there's a Templar's cross here and there's a tower behind but I can't get in, the whole thing is like uh, behind you know and it's in the French speaking part of Belgium so um, not very far from Liège, uh, Lutech in German and Liège there are, there's a, a, an enormously big uh, uh, military um, industrial complex called uh, Fabrique Nationale and even we in South Africa we had the guns from them you know it's called it was called the R2 in England too the L1A1 and even in America in the 50s because before they had the M14 uh, 308 they had the, um, uh, the the Belgium gun and now their new series even the FBI and all you know a lot of uh, special forces and all that, uh, they, they have these guns, even the police. Uh, it's called FN, Fabrique Nationale. So this is very, it's not very far from here. So it's all connected to the Templars, uh, there's no doubt. Just like there's on the Swiss Army knife, there is the, uh, the Templars cross on the, uh, on the Swiss Army knife. I mean, well here it is, I'll show it to you. Yeah. Templar's cross on the Swiss Army now. So it's all Templar related. So I'm gonna try and uh, ring somewhere so I can get in here. Uh, there's a prison in here as well. Look. If they would know I was here, they'll put me in there. And of course the Freemasons, their descendants, they uh, come out of these guys here, the Templars, who are aristocrats, and who are, of course, pharaohs. Watch my videos like Octagon, the Empire of Darkness and the rest. And the Nazis, they were the Nazi Templars. So you see the Command Re, here's the tower, you know, watchtower. It goes all around here. And it's inside. Apparently the... And in the church there should be some graves of the Templars, but it was closed. So I hear the entrance of it, and apparently uh, there are apartments in here. They build apartments. It's, it's most certainly their descendants. And if the civil war starts, they just close the doors, you know. So shall I go in? Yeah, let's have a look. So there you can see the two Templars towers here. And that's also part of it. Here is the, uh, I'm inside here. And there too, there are the apartments further on. I'm not going any further. In France it wouldn't be any problem, but in Belgium there are, I don't know. Uh, there are some nice people here though. I just, a lady in a bar, she gave me a soup. Very nice. There's another castle here. Opposite the Templar stuff. That's the Templar stuff, so of course it's part of it. Yeah, it is apparently oh, a, dog, a watchdog. This is octagonal here. So this is from the 16th century, it says. Yeah. Manoir, de la, Manoir de la Tour. But what do I see here? Yeah. 
the order of malt. Private property. Oh, there's another bell. Oh, I love the bells. Let's ring, eh? Oh, it's, it's broken. Yeah, not too bad. There's the bell. <laughs> All these middle-aged bells here. Well, so, but descendants of the Templars, no doubt. So on the wall here of the Templars Commandery, there's some really weird signs here. Can anybody tell me what it says? That's really weird, man. Some extraterrestrial stuff on it. Pyramid. Another Templar symbol. Some extraterrestrial stuff. Whoa. So it's like here, and on top of it is this here. Three, no, four. So on the Templars building on the other side of the church. In Villers, Le Temple. A commandery. So here they build apartments next to it. Yeah. Wonder what the names are. Oh. They have a big garden, so they're like the Yeah. So that was all the, the commandery here. All these buildings here and this here. Yeah, quite big. And inside, of course, is a wall, another door. And here, on the church, there's some old graves, gravestones here. And this is not 15, 1500 and something. That's 1600 and something. But it gets older here. There's also 1600. Look, Freemasons, Freemasons, of course, you know, they're not pirates. <laughs> uh, it's not uh, Johnny Depp, well, he's one of them. That's why he made that pirate film, of course. No doubt. 1647, and here was one, this is uh, 1764. And this was a very old one. Here it says 1198, I think. This is also. This is during the Templars' time. Oh, it says here. It's worn off by the t with the time. And here, this is Hebrew. There's a Templars' cross, and I think Hebrew in the middle of it, or pyramid, or a coat of arms. So this is 1694. Hmm. You know. So, Templars in uh, Villar uh, Le Temple. And of course, I tell you again, the Templars, they were the second and the third sons of the aristocracy and they couldn't rule. It was only permitted for the first son, so they made a new system, which is the new world order. In short, watch my other videos. So this is called the Square of the King. Place Roi Baudouin. Baudouin. Uh, Roi. It's the king. So this is the king, and there are his Templars, just there, and here. So in fact, we're still in the Middle Ages. They only wrapped it around into a new world order. Now, there used to be a sun hieroglyph. You can still see it here. There it is. Oh. And that says, plus, plus of the, the square of the king. Oh, fantastic. They're just hiding, you know. So they must be afraid of us. So there it is, this thing there, Villers, Villers Le Temple. I came by this road, the N63. You see, here's the river. It goes all the way to Switzerland. La Meuse. So if you follow La Meuse, you get to Liège. It's not very far. And here's Erstal. You see that, Herstal. And that's where the biggest, one of Europe, maybe, it, I think it's Europe's biggest weapon factories. So it's really quite near. It's always Templar connected, of course aristocracy connected, 
They're the war makers, they always did. They parasite on us through wars, killing people, children, terrorizing us, torturing us, because they just want to parasite on us. That's why we have the terrorist attacks and all that. So they can have some um, geostrategical war for the petrol, for the oil in Iraq and the the opium in Afghanistan, you see? So it's real near. I could walk it, you know, just it's not very far. And the rivers, they were like in the Middle Ages. They were like the highways, the motorways in Europe. So, and it's even connected to Switzerland, you know. So, through this, Villers le, le Temple, they got real easy there, you know, real easy. It's all connected. I'm 100% sure if I go to Erstal, I'll find some more Templar stuff. Well, that's me. Pharaoh. It says that it is a commandery. Yeah. And so here in uh, Villiers Le Temple. And here you can see the Maltese cross, the cross of the Templars. Villiers Le, Le Temple. It must be Latin. Yeah. So in the bar they told me there's a guy who's, uh, who likes the Templars. He's got a couple of houses. It says the Noble House. Yo, so he knows the Templars are the, the aristocracy. I can't see what his name is. He's got a Flemish name. Well, let's ring the bell. There is an. And next to where he lives, I saw this. Chatelain. That means the guy who's living in a castle, a chateau. And Malt is the order of Malta. With the round circles everywhere. So that's just living next to next door to where this guy is living with the Malt, with the cross. So. These guys are everywhere, man. So the other bloke was just, just living down, down the corner there. 